boy. And we are back. We are back. I know it's been a minute, but if you are ready for me to give you these top five fall essentials so that you can level up your game for the fall, hey man, hey, stay tuned. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy JMO704, and welcome to the channel where we discuss everything from beard care to menswear. And you know, we might sprinkle a little bit of fitness in between so that you can feel as good on the outside as you do on the inside. So, if this is your first time coming to the channel, I just want to say welcome and thank you for coming and checking out the content because, uh, yeah, I mean, it's not really. A whole lot of people checking me out right now, which is cool. Stop the cap. <laughs> but, you know, I definitely appreciate you stopping through. And while you're here, if you enjoy the video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you like it even more, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And after you do both of that, go ahead and hit those bell notifications so that you can know every time that I drop a brand new video here on the channel. And before we get into the video, man, if you're not following your boy over on Instagram, what are you doing with your life, man? Go ahead and make sure you follow your boy over on Instagram at jmo704. And this is where you can catch a lot of my fitness-related content, some of my style-related content, but even more importantly, man, hey, if y'all want to get to know me a little bit better, man, this is where you can see some of the behind the scenes you know just me on a day-to-day -day. i ask a lot of uh ask a lot of polls ask a lot of crazy questions over there man and so if y'all want to see what the ladies are thinking man hey go on over to my instagram follow your boy over there and let's get into these top five fall essentials so man let me tell you fall is my favorite time of the year especially whenever it comes to wardrobe style and all that kinds of stuff, man. Um, not only because I'm tired of it just being hot as f outside, man. Cause down here in North Carolina, yo. You okay, Mike? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, this is how we do it in North Carolina. It really doesn't start getting cool until I would say mid to late October, beginning of November, and I'm just and I'll just be ready for a break from the heat. And you know, I mean, summertime is cool, you know, to rock the jerseys and some tight shirts. And you know, uh, if you ain't been skipping leg day, oh my God, to show off the legs and, and things like that. But man, I just feel like fall is where it's at, man. You know, just in terms of putting together different color combinations, different textures, you know, if you want to be super dressed up or if you want to you know be more casual with your style man i just feel like fall time just gives you that that versatility and that diversity that you need you know within your wardrobe and your own personal style so you know for me whenever i'm thinking about putting together my fall wardrobe i'm really just kind of thinking about uh different different color combinations you know uh things that would look really nice together i'm thinking about you know can i dress certain things up can i can I dress it down? Uh, I'm playing around with different textures, but man, most importantly, you know, I'm just thinking about pieces that are timeless, you know, um, whether I wear it today or five years from now, or, you know, five years ago, like it really doesn't matter, you know, because for me, like, I, I don't know about y'all, but I don't necessarily have a wardrobe budget to necessarily buy new pieces year after year after year no i think that if you can buy some classic just kind of staple pieces you can wear these year after year and still be in style and not have to break the bank but in order to be stylish you know so with my five fall essentials these are five classic pieces that you can add to your wardrobe and guess what it is not gonna break the bank i got y'all man so don't even don't even don't even worry about it so because again to me i think you can be fly as hell without necessarily having to break the bank you know what i'm saying for me at this point in point in my life and some of the things that i'm trying to do and some of the goals that i have i don't necessarily have the the extra money to go out and spend on 
uh, brand new clothes right now. Come on, I'm broke, baby. I ain't got no money. You know, so in this video, all five of my pieces are actually uh, things that I already have in my wardrobe. You know, just to show you guys that, hey, you know, as long as you pick out the right pieces, you can wear these things year after year after year and they will still be in style. And even just to show you even more proof, man, I'm gonna put up some shots from uh, previous posts on my Instagram just to show you guys that, hey, you know, as long as you buy decent quality uh, pieces and, and clothing, hey, you, you, you set for the next few seasons, okay? So, with that being said, let's get into my first fall essential. And that is the varsity jacket. You know, for me, I've always kind of been obsessed with the varsity collegiate style, uh, you know, the kind of preps the style, man. That's, I've always kind of been obsessed with that. And I feel like the varsity jacket just kind of gives you that that diversity and that, that versatility that, that you need within your wardrobe. Um, believe it or not, I actually got this uh, varsity jacket from Old Navy and uh, and the one that I have here, you know, as you see, as you see right here, um, this varsity jacket is one that I got from Forever 21. So again, you know, you don't have to break the bank in order to be stylish. Now, I mean, if you do have it in your wheelhouse and, and your funds, you might you might be balling, you know, and, and can afford to, to get a nice expensive varsity jacket. But if you're anything like me, and you know you really trying to elevate in life without necessarily having to to break the bank you know definitely got some good options for you check the link down in the description because i do have some uh varsity jackets that i do think you guys would like number two on the list of my top five fall essentials dark denim jeans yo i'm trying to tell you you cannot go wrong with a nice crisp pair of dark denim jeans you know the ones that I have on here in this video, these are from H&M. I think, I can't remember how much I paid for them. I actually had to go back and look, but I'll put the price uh, right up here on the screen for you so you guys can see. And I also have it in the uh, in the description for you guys as well. But I do think that uh, dark denim jeans are a classic staple for any guy in his uh, fall wardrobe. You know, again, you can dress it up. If you have a job that requires you to, you know, be a little bit more formal, but you know, you can still kind of be a little bit more casual too, you know, and it, and it, and your job allows for that flexibility. I think that, uh, you know, some dark denim jeans are a good alternative. As you can see, I pair my dark denim jeans with a pair of uh, wingtip boots. Also got those boots from H&M and I paired it with a varsity jacket, a jingham shirt, in a in a knitted tie and you know and if i wanted to dress it down of course you know what i'm saying i'm rocking a, in a champion georgetown uh sweatshirt with the hoyas hat i'm not a hoya or you know really even georgetown but i do like one of my favorite colors is navy blue so you know what i mean hey anything navy blue i always like to pair that together because i just think it looks uh just think it looks cool but you know so that's what i got uh, for my dark denim jeans, that's my number two. That's my number two. Top five fall essentials for the fall. Coming in at number three, which kind of leads me to the next thing, you know, is sweatshirts. Whether it's sweatshirts, sweatpants, sweatsuit, you know, man, this is the this is the time of year where you know, hey man, it's sweatpants season, you know. And that's our, it's our time to shine, fellas. It's our time, man. So don't let nobody tell you that you can't wear no sweatpants. Nah, man, I'm just messing with y'all. But, you know, man, hey, whenever it comes to sweatpants season, it's almost the equivalent of, you know, when, when women wear they, wear they sundresses, you know? You see some things moving and shaking. And when it's our turn, man, it's time to see what's hanging and banging. Huh? It's hanging and banging. Huh? You stupid. Yeah, nah, that didn't. <laughs> that didn't go over too well, did it? Yeah, nah, I ain't think so. But anyways, man, y'all know what I mean, man. For me, my brand of choice is Champion. As you can see, 
rocking the champion uh, sweatshirt today, uh, you know, because I, I like the quality. I like the thickness of it, you know, and um, and I just feel warm and I feel cozy in it, man. Uh, even here, you know, I'm rocking it again. I'm rocking the Georgetown Hoya uh, sweatshirt. But, you know, I mean, any type of sweatshirt will do. You know, I've gotten sweatshirts from, of course, uh, H&M. I've seen some on ASOS that I really like and dig and, and you know, and plan on uh, adding to my wardrobe. But, you know, uh, I just think that sweatshirts just kind of give you this cool, relaxed kind of kind of vibe, you know, for the fall. So that is my number three uh, essential for the fall. Coming in at number four. Like me, J Mo 704. And got from Detroit. I come from that 704 Charlotte Mabel. And you can And if you hadn't already, why you ain't like the video? Go ahead and like that video and quit BSing me, man, on them likes. Nah, but uh coming in at number four is the Chelsea boot. Now, I know a lot of I know a lot of people gonna say I, I've been I've been seeing this meme floating around here lately that you know for the fall we just gonna be killing them with uh turtlenecks pea coats chelsea boots and you know some some gold necklaces or whatever and i mean can't even front you probably are gonna see me with a pea coat you probably are gonna see me with some chelsea boots and you probably are gonna see me with a turtleneck but you know what all three of those pieces again are classic and you can wear those things year after year after year and as you can see right here you know i got an all black ensemble you know for the fall sometimes i like to be monochromatic with the look you know i just think i just think it gives a nice little silhouette to your frame to your look and i mean you really just can't go wrong with wearing all black but uh but for this particular look you know i got on the black chelsea boots from asos you know um also got a link to where you can find some Chelsea boots in the description as well. And whenever it comes to Chelsea boots, again, it's really all up to your preference of what kind of look that you're going for. Whether you wanna, whether you wanna be more casual with it, or you know if you wanna dress it up some. So, you know, so that rounds out number four on my top five fall essentials. And yeah, I said four because I'm from, I'm, I'm from North Carolina, man. And I'm from the country, man, and that's that's just how we talk. But anyways, coming in at number five, yeah, number five, rounding out the list on my top five fall essentials is the denim jacket. Again, man, hey, if you haven't noticed, all of the looks that I have on my list are just quality, timeless, classic pieces, you know? not doing anything crazy not doing anything you know out the ordinary but again you know you want to pick pieces that you can wear uh today five years ago and five years from now you know so rounding out my list is the jean jacket the denim jacket the denim jacket that i'm wearing here is from polo ralph lauren i know that i said that i was going to give y'all affordable pieces and yeah you know, this was actually a Christmas gift from my girl uh, last year, you know. So I have been looking at this jacket for a minute. And of course, y'all know I like the navy, uh, you know, and I like the gold. You know, shout out to all my Aggies out there. Aggie pride. You already know how it goes down. HBCU stand up. But anyways, man, um, I'm rocking a polo jean jacket in this one. You know, hey, want to dress it up, want to dress it down, you know. I just think the jean jacket gives a certain level of versatility within your wardrobe to where, you know, you can pair with a hoodie, t-shirt, and you know what I'm saying, just going about your day. Or, you know, if you want to dress it up a little bit, you know, you also have that, that versatility as well. So, man, that tops out my top five all essentials. Just to recap, you know, one varsity jacket two got the dark denim jeans on deck number three any type of sweatshirt crew neck sweatshirt whatever you good or chelsea boots coming all kinds of colors textures heights whatever get you some and rounding out five is the jean jacket so man 
Um, so these are my fall essentials. This is what I'm going to be, you know, killing it with in the fall and I'm not breaking the bank. Before we wrap up the video, if you are not following your boy, make sure you go ahead and follow your boy over on Instagram at jmo704. And if you are looking for online coaching, go ahead and hit the link down in the description and apply for my coaching, man. Hey, look, man, I know that we are about to embark on the holiday season where y'all gonna be eating it up. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Got Thanksgiving, got Christmas, got New Year's, but man, you know, if you really want to see some success whenever it comes to your fitness goals, it's best to go ahead and get on it now so that whenever the new year does come, man, you already in good shape and you're not struggling to lose those excess pounds that i know y'all about to put on when thanksgiving and christmas hits so go ahead and apply for the uh for the coaching and and do i have anything else i want to leave y'all with nah i think that's it so again i appreciate y'all coming through checking out the video seeing what my top five essentials are let me know down in the comments you know how are you gonna kill it for the fall you know I would be super interested to know and also you know if you like any of the uh any of the recommendations that i gave also let me know that down in the comments too so until the next time youtube peace